Hello, I'm Michael Crossland, business reporter with the Yorkshire Post, and these are some of today's top business headlines from across Yorkshire. In the latest news from data company One Disco, the firm's interim chief executive Stephen Kelly has described 2022 as a wasted year, but promised that 2023 will be a year of real transition. The firm hit headlines earlier this year after announcing it had discovered potentially fraudulent irregularities in its reported sales and revenues, which led to it asking for its shares to be suspended. The firm later went on to announce that this was caused by a singular senior sales employee. The latest announcement from Mondisco comes as the firm releases its preliminary unaudited results for the financial year, where it's reported an adjusted EBITDA loss of £24 million for the period, compared to £23.4 million in 2021. In other news, Poundland has begun recruiting for 120 new roles in Yorkshire after outlining plans to create a second digital distribution centre. The site will be based in Dalton in South Yorkshire. We also have news from JMG Group, which is based in Geisley, which announced that it has already made its 10th acquisition of 2023 by acquiring Cheshire-based insurance firm Blackfriars Group. And finally, speaking at the Foresight Net Zero live event in Hull last night, American nuclear firm X Energy outlined its plans to create a coast-to-coast northern nuclear deployment strategy. If these plans go forward, it will include the construction of a new advanced modular reactor in Teesside, as well as a fuel fabricating plant in the northwest. I'm Michael Crossland, reporting for the Yorkshire Post.